What's up guys? In this video, I'm going to review Custom Cat. They're a print on demand production partner that needs to be on your radar. There is one product type specifically that they really excel at relative to their competition. Don't worry. I'm going to explain everything you need to know in this video. And I'm going to show you, if you stay till the end, I'm going to show you me testing their coffee mugs because they boasted you can throw them off of a balcony, off of a roof. And they won't break. So I went outside and uh, me and Marielle threw four of them off of the balcony. I'm going to show you the results. Also, obviously, I'm going to do some uh, product quality reviews because they very graciously sent me some of their products. I got a, I got a hat, a t-shirt, and some coffee mugs to show you. So stay tuned, guys. This is going to be a good one. Let's get started. Real quick, just wanted to remind you, I run a weekly print-on-demand giveaway. It's completely free to enter. Every Sunday, two winners are selected. This week, sponsored by Merch Titans Upload Automation, Merch Ninja Research Tools for Print-on-Demand, and All Sunset's premium pre-made sunset graphics for print-on-demand. So check that out. Link in the description. Also in the description, you can find my free mini course. So we got a free giveaway, a free print-on-demand mini course that will be delivered to your inbox over eight days, and my print-on-demand Facebook community. If you'd like to join, I'd love to have you. All right, so let's start talking about Custom Cat. Uh, they are, you know, I mean, if we're just being honest, they're like most of the print-on-demand production partners that you've heard of, you know, Printful, Printify, Gearbubble, Custom Cat, et cetera. Guten, I mean, the list goes on. There's a ton of companies getting into the print-on-demand space because there's a lot of money to be made. Now, what you're probably watching this video for is for me to tell you what sets them apart from their competitors. And... I don't want to bury the lead too long, but let me cover some of other high level stuff. And then I will tell you one reason why you really need to be using them. All right. So also I just wanted to let you know on their website, you can find videos from their factory. You can see how their production runs go. Um, I've checked out a couple of them and it's good stuff. So they, this is another thing that should be on your radar. They've got over 300 uniquely customizable products to choose from. And I was surprised by that actually, because I was really looking to them for one product type specifically that I keep alluding to. And then I went through their catalog and I was like, whoa, this thing is, I mean, it's huge. Their catalog is absolutely massive. Don't worry. I'm going to preview it for you. Uh, they say 40,000 units produced and shipped daily. I assume that's on average 50,000 plus partners powering their businesses with custom cat worldwide. So that's a lot of people using them for either fulfillment or using them uh, in their integrations for their online e-commerce print on demand businesses. And they've got 20 years in the game doing print on demand fulfillment. Uh, I found this on their website after doing some digging. Now it never hurts to include a shipping map. So they are lo located in Michigan. I think it was Detroit, Michigan when I looked. So depending on where you're shipping to, you can actually behind me, I'm blocking it, but you can see the uh, color coding of this map and how many days you can expect it to take for ground shipping. The red is four days. The orange, the burnt orange is five days. And uh, I don't see any burnt orange. Actually, no, it's in Oregon and um, Indiana up there in the top left. And I think that's it. The other brownish orange is only uh, two days. All right, so integrations. This is also something that I'm sure a lot of you guys are wondering. What can we integrate them with? Because if you're like me, you want stuff to be automated and as passive as possible. So we need those integrations that automatically detect orders and fulfill them and upload tracking so that we don't have to do that, right? So we can focus on other things like scaling. And uh, currently, they have these integrations. They've got Shopify, WooCommerce, Etsy. That's a big one. I really think, guys, if you're not selling on Etsy after this video, please go do it. I actually have a really, I, I mean, my most successful video on my channel. I was going to say really successful video, but it doesn't sound right. But literally the biggest video on my channel is my Etsy print-on-demand tutorial. So check that out. I can put it in the YouTube cards right here if you want to. Uh, Custom Cat is a great option for um, a production partner that integrates with Etsy. The Etsy integration, by the way, guys, it takes like two clicks. It's the easiest one out of all of them. Uh, Big Commerce, they've got an API, and then you can also create orders via CSV upload. All right, so like I was just saying, <laughs> and I'll put a link to that uh, Etsy video, but Custom Cat plus Etsy plus coffee mugs, I may be alluding to my favorite product that Custom Cat can fulfill here, is a thumbs up. That is something that should be on your radar. So let's talk about products. Now, this is just screenshotted from their website because it looks cool, but I'm actually going to show you a glimpse at their catalog of not even, this is probably like half the products that they sell because I really only went down the uh, men's. They've got it split by like men's, women's, children. I just went down the men's and uh, that's what I'm going to show you here. So these are the top sellers and you see they've got coffee mugs, they've got t-shirts, tank tops, hats, uh, blankets, etc. I'm going to preview them like I said, but I had to put a little star next to coffee mugs. That is because... They thrive at coffee mugs, not only because the quality 
is as good as you're going to find anywhere. And don't worry, I'm going to preview it for you because like I said, they sent me some mugs for me to review in person. But also the base costs. I couldn't find more competitive as in lower priced coffee mugs anywhere else on the internet. I mean, keep in mind, I was recommending prior to finding out about Custom Cat, I was saying you can go pay for Gear Bubbles monthly integrations at $97 a month because at least you're saving on coffee mugs. Like Printful charges, I think $6.95 or $7.95. I think it's $7.95. It's either $6.95 or $7.95 for an 11 ounce white mug. Printful charges $4.95 for an 11 ounce white mug. Custom Cat, for reference, $3.75 for an 11 ounce white mug. So you can have the most competitive pricing that you'll find anywhere by using Custom Cat for coffee mugs. And like I said, I'm going to review the coffee mugs for you later and show you that they don't break when they're shipped. Now they've got a wide selection of shirts, including short sleeve, long sleeve, raglan, v-neck, all over print. They've got hoodies, both pullover hoodies and zip hoodies. They've got a pretty wide selection of polo shirts, surprisingly, and jackets and tank tops and pants. I mean, look at all the options here. They've got a uh, baby slash toddler shirt, which, I mean, if anybody's selling on Etsy, I know those can be popular, especially because you can enable personalization, which is perfect for print on demand. They've got a, a wide variety of hats. I believe I am wearing the CP90 knit cat, knit cap. Uh, they've got bags. What is that? One, two, three, four. They've got 18 different bags. Well, yeah, maybe that's like 17 bags and then three laptop sleeves. You know, Actually, even a, a laptop briefcase. That's interesting. Uh, they've got jewelry including a dog pet tag. So that's interesting on the in a bone shape. They've got customizable flip-flops. They have 12 customizable blankets. They've got wall art available. They've got customizable towels, including a microfiber golf towel. That could be interesting. And they've got customizable ornaments. All right, let's take a peek at the quality of some of the products that I got to review. So here is the t-shirt that I am wearing. This is a next level apparel shirt. I do like it. It's nice and fitted um, for anybody that's athletic. The, the color came out really well and the print quality also, it's not too zoomed in here, but you can see that in their logo, they've got like kind of a, I don't know, I'm just guessing like two pixel line of, you know, against the green, they've got white and against the white, they've got green and it's hard, maybe hard to see in this picture, but it did print really well and really crisp. And as far as the next level apparel goes, I mean, those shirts sell all day as far as print on demand goes. And um, I'm sure, I mean, personally, I like this shirt. Uh, they also sent me a Gildan Heavy Cotton shirt. I'm not as big a fan of the Gildan Heavy Cotton shirts. I've seen them in the past and uh, just not really. I just don't like the way they fit. I don't know. They're just big, baggy, loose, and heavy, honestly. Uh, and they put a hamburger here. Now, when I showed it to my girlfriend, Marielle, she said, whoa, that thing looks 3D, partially because it's printed really well, but also because like, the shirt being kind of wrinkled from me having it in my closet for a while waiting to do this video because I was waiting for them to um, upgrade their website uh, partially made it look more real. They also sent me this beanie, as you can see, and the embroidery. Uh, I don't really know how else to put it other than that, you know, you can see what the design is. It's a nice beanie. And as far as embroidered hats go, which I've sold quite a few of in my time running a print on demand business online, um, this is as good as anything I've seen before now for the fun part coffee mugs coffee mugs i think they really excel at and what i wanted to show you here is how they're packaged so they come in a cardboard box the cardboard box ranges in size based on the size of the mug so 11 ounce mugs are smaller you get a different um plastic i don't know what to call it plastic like capsule and it's actually two pieces one goes on the bottom one goes on the top and it kind of suspends it it's 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 uh it's not touching the box itself so if the box drops the mug itself will not be impacted on any one side um, with the box, so it won't transfer the direct contact from the box like falling. That's that, The reason I share that is because I'm going to be throwing them off a balcony in a second. Uh, and you can see there, so it's the box, and then it's the two pieces of plastic surrounding the mug. The boxes and the plastic are made to fit the mug itself, so it's very exact, which ultimately I think has a lot to do with why they don't break. So in this first review, you can just see here how they look close up when they come out of the box with those two plastic protecting, uh, I don't know what to call them, sleeves or something. Uh, you can see here the print quality also is nice. That's a pretty complex image there of a old-timey Western store. And also the color scheme, the gradient in the sky. I mean, it all prints very nicely on this mug. And you can see um, from the bottom there, it's the Orca Coatings mugs made in China. And I've seen those like you know, 
when I've ordered gifts in the past prior to me running my print on demand business, I've looked at some of those mugs that I had purchased and I'm it, it was those mugs. So I know that this mug holds up because I've seen some that I've purchased myself as gifts uh, hold up over the years. Um, so I know that that's a quality brand as far as the mug goes. Here's another mug. This is so this was an 11 ounce black mug. This is a 15 ounce mug and you can see it's got a galaxy pattern on it. Red, blue, etc. Um, again, print quality is about as good as I'd expect it to be. Here we have a color changing mug. So on the left there, you see that it is hard to really see that there's, I mean, you can kind of tell there's a design on there, but not really. When you pour water in it, you see this behind me here. It actually turns white from black. And then you can see the full color showing through of the mug. And I will also overlay in post-production a video that I took of another color changing mug where I poured the water in and I captured it changing colors completely. So here you go. You can't even tell if that mug was black prior to the hot water being poured inside. And um, look at the print quality there as well of that landscape. Really nice. They have two-tone mugs. So here you see the like lime green and white. And a blue, light blue and white mug. So little preview. I threw, well, Marielle threw both of these off of the uh, balcony. And one of them, I do believe broke. All right, so... Here's the experiment I was alluding to. Let's have some fun. Okay, guys, we're gonna run a test throwing these three mugs off of the uh, balcony. And I will record from the bottom perspective, but we got the uh, green and white two-tone mug. And we're gonna throw that inside the cardboard with it closed. Then we're gonna test this uh, two-tone mug right here with the face on it, the crazy face. And we're gonna not band them together so the pieces may come off and then we're going to throw this one right here where the pieces are going to be banded together to make sure that you know we get the full effect and we'll see what happens all right so we are here we are ready marielle's recording up there i'm recording down here all right yeah go for it yeah underhand underhand that was a good that was a good landing i don't know we'll see what happens with that box That might, that might have survived. All right, now we actually threw in one more unannounced that we're gonna throw onto the uh, hard landing, but we're gonna keep it in the box, in the plastic covering. So this one you can overhand, make sure you get it here. Don't, don't hit me. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, we had a little bit of a break somewhere. Yep, that did not survive. Let's see if the ones in the grass had better luck. Success. No damage done. Right here, no damage done. And without anything holding it together because it fits so snugly in there, no damage done. Three for four. And that's it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you've used Custom Cat, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I'd love to hear from you. And if you have any questions, also feel free to ask. And uh, just wanted to remind you, I wrote a full print on demand course. I've got over four years experience. I make six figure plus print on demand sales every year. If you'd like to learn from me my exact ways, and this is geared towards beginners, but then it shows you how to scale to intermediate and eventually what I would call expert where you automate as much as possible. So check that out, link in the description. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching guys. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow.